Hello everyone, here we are in Mobile, Alabama, coming up on a couple of littoral combat ships of the Independence class at the location where these are manufactured. The one on the left is the USS Mobile. It's turned over to the Navy as of this time, but not commissioned yet. The one on the right is going to be the USS Savannah, and it's still going under a lot of construction. This type of littoral combat ship is built on a trimaran hull. It can go 44 knots top speed, 51 miles an hour. Up there are some of the plants, final assembly further up and lower level assembly to the right. There's no propellers in the back of this ship. It's all internal. It comes out as water jets. You got a couple of helicopter hangars. Some defensive systems. And then you have some vertical launch rockets, anti-ship, and a two and a quarter or two and a half inch gun. And of course these ships are not meant to be in heavy duty fights against powerful enemies or part of a carrier battle group for the most part. It's meant for some of the lower level conflicts where also speed would be important. They are planning on adding some anti-submarine warfare capabilities to some of these vessels however. All right, so we're going to head out driving by one of the plants. This is the larger plant, but not as tall, so they do the lower level subassemblies, not the top level shipbuilding. And then the lot there, you can see some of the pieces of the ship that you can make out. Thanks for watching, everyone.